Thank you for tuning in to another Lavelle Clater's Projects with a Purpose. Um, this is an activity I just wanted to share with you that I use with a couple uh, middle school students, just teaching them how to use Excel and learn a little bit about conditional formatting. So if you look to your left of the screen, you will see uh, like a quiz. So the students received a piece of paper with the parts of the screen and they had to type in the answer that that particular part um, described. So for the sheet tab, they had to put in a number, the number, the answer is number two. But what I want you to do is focus on this area because a, a picture or some words will appear if the answer is correct. So the answer for number, the first one is number two. And as you see, what it did is started to put together a picture. Then the next answer was number four. And then it put in another part of the picture. So the students uh, kind of figure like, mm, not sure what it is just yet. So as they answered the questions correctly, part of the picture appeared. But if they put in the wrong answer, someone put a zero. And if you notice, nothing appeared. But if I go back and put the correct answer, then the C showed up. And I'm just gonna continue through and I think by now you should, you may know what it is. Uh, let me see. So this one and this one. And we got a couple more and then we'll be done. And, and then okay, so it was a Pikachu. But this was a good activity for the students to be creative. Um, they would use um, graphic paper and draw out the picture or the words that they wanted to appear and then base the picture color on the answer. So if number two, let me take this out because I can't remember which color is what. So if number two is the answer, then the parts of the black would show up. So each number actually had a color that went with it. So four equal yellow two equal black and then on, so on and so forth. So just wanted to share, um, hoping you're having a great day and I will upload another awesome Excel project soon. Have a great day.